Hello there guys, welcome back to another video and today I'm actually going to be doing a small update on the Jupiter C drama that happened quite a while ago because I've now got every single side of all the owners from what happened. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to read out for John, which he sent to me last Tuesday. Okay, so it all started when me and Toby merged with Chicken and Being Bored. Being Bored made an argument with me and Toby, so John and Toby. So I said this was when um, The Hidden Evil was Toby's um, developer and no, owner on Toby's server and developer on GPMC. So he said, yeah, when I was co-owner on Toby's server and dev on GPMC. So the argument was that Toby and being, being bored did what they want on their own realm. And I can't touch their realm, so. Um, being bored made this agreement, as I'm pretty sure most of you guys will remember. And it was going all really well. Until being bored said that Toby and my realm uh, were making more money than his realm. And basically that's when he feels that it started. So it all started then, how Being Bored and Toby started fighting because Being Bored server was making more money than, um, than Being Bored server. Toby and I had to remind Being Bored about it a few times. Then one day, Being Bored had enough, so he wanted to kick Toby when he was offline. Which as you guys can tell, that's just a scumbag move. That's, that's not okay. So that's literally the face I called. Me and Chicken were there having no idea what was, ab what was about to happen until he changed the password to everything. So then Toby noticed, he asked me what happened, I lost access as well. So then I replied with, so basically being bored scammed GPMC. Which in a sense, that is what it looks like. So he replies back, yeah, but that went on. Toby made his own server we went on with GPMC until me and Chicken had enough of being bored. Because look, how would you feel if some, someone was offline for three days, then come back, then came back for one hour and changed everything you do to his own way and then go offline for another few days? So then, of course, I replied back with an honest opinion, like all they did was screw up and do nothing to help. Which, in all fairness, if you guys think that you had a friend or someone you thought was a friend, that was constantly um, using what you were doing for, your, for their own benefit. So he replied back, yeah. Um, then I said, and only use the people who do, who do to their advantage, basically saying that um, he was using Toby, um, Hidden and Chicken to his advantage to boost his reputation. Then I also see from being bored side as well. That was what being bored was doing to us, yeah. Just so you know, I never meant to make any of you guys look bad, because in my last video I kind of made these guys out to look like the bad people, but that was mainly because I didn't know the full story and I only knew one side and I just wanted to keep you guys updated to what was actually going on. Um, so I told him, just so you know, I never meant to make any of you guys look bad. He said, yes I know, but being bored was. As I'd only heard two sides of the story. Yeah. Me and Chicken were in the middle, Toby and being bored until the end. Yeah, it was a massive argument between two people who didn't get on. Okay, so Hidden said, yeah, so Chicken decided to kick being bored, well, not only Chicken. That involved everyone on the server and conflicted everyone. So the whole mess, that the whole drama that went on, for basically just one error, for someone logging on, changing everything to their way, which can be really annoying caused everyone to get involved in the whole situation that was going on but yeah yeah so um, so Chicken had this plan with me on how to kick Being Bored we were going to do it when Being Bored was asleep it was to it was to when Being Bored it was when Being Bored was asleep 
He changed the pass he changed the password while I kicked him from the Discord and removed his perms. Then it was over and it and it worked. But Chicken did something that was not planned. Remember the big announcement about Chicken going to China? And I said, yeah, that was made up, because I'm pretty sure like 95% of us already knew that it was made up. So Hidden then said, yeah, so that happened. Um, I then replied back saying it was made up so they had an excuse to kick being broad, basically saying that they had enough of him and they just wanted a story to get away of being able to kick him. Because of the attitude he'd been treating them, um, the way he had been as a staff member. Uh, yeah, but it failed because that, because then Chicken forgot to say that I was supposed to be in charge of QPMC, but failed. So a day after that, we kicked him. It was a bit out of order, but yeah, because he uses leaked stuff and setups, which if you guys think about it, for a good network at the moment, using leaked stuff just puts in back doors to your servers, gives people op and whatever. And using setups isn't really the best thing either. So, um, I know that um, Chicken has used the copy of Blizzard, but he is, make but he is making it custom to himself. And then of course everyone keeps on calling Hidden and Chicken out and Toby for using setups, although it's Toby. No, it's it's not Toby, it's being bored. Um, well, to be honest, Chicken is using a copy of Blizzard. Yeah, but he wasn't using setups when being bored around was around. So, a few more things from Hidden. He said, It started when being bored got kicked. Then I had to remake all the servers like Bungie Cord and Hub while he remakes the Jeep Faction Realm. Then we, then we released blah blah blah, then Toby came back. This story is very undetailed, but I actually think that he's managed to get a lot of detail through that. Because he's explained the reason why being bored got kicked, why Toby got kicked. So I hope this kind of relaxes some people who are still a bit EVG on why um, being bored got kicked instead of Toby. Because I was a bit under the um, under and um, well I didn't really know either. Um, so I asked why did Chicken decide to start GFMC? So because he said and um, well any questions, so I wanted to really know why the background was for creating GFMC. So he replies back, um, I'm not really that sure, all I know is that it was Supreme Factions then GPMC. Yeah, and I remember GP I remember Supreme Factions really well. Um, then he goes on to talk about some new um, stuff on Warlock which is looking amazing guys, I'm not going to lie to you. It is starting to look absolutely fantastic, I cannot wait for it to come out. Like seriously guys, there are so many cool features on it. I'm going to try and show you guys a little bit of a snippet, so if I do slash server warlock, I will have to blur out some of this guys, but it looks amazing. So I'll try and ask Hidden what bits I can show you, but they are still working on the server, how everything happened, but then also wanting to get to the bottom of it. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and if you have, don't forget to slap that like button and subscribe, and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Bye!